Have you ever just wanted to ride off into the sunset? To do something just entirely for yourself? Something new? Something outside the box? Something that's not really accepted by everyone else? But just because it's exciting and because you can, you want to do it? To have a new adventure? To have an experience like you've never had before? That's where AirCrete is taking a lot of people. Um, who uses AirCrete? Who builds with AirCrete? Well, in my experience from the people I've met, it's often people who are wiped out from a natural disaster, uh, wiped out from losing a job, wiped out from a divorce, or on the flip side, it's people who have worked their entire life in the cities and now they're finally ready to follow their heart's desire to move away from the crime and the noise and the pollution, sell their big fancy house, and live in something small and beautiful, something manageable, and something meaningful, something they've made with their own two hands, to live a richness of life that just isn't found in the normal way that society lives. And occasionally you have the young traveler who just simply wants to travel the world and needs a place to stay, to put their things, and a place to come home to after world travels to recharge the bank account and rest and relax. All of these people have very unique situations and yet each of them have found a solution with Aircrete. But I guess I'm getting ahead of myself. What exactly is Aircrete? Well, if you don't know, Aircrete is basically a structural insulating building material that's made of Portland cement. We take soap and we make a foam and then we inflate a bag of Portland cement six times in volume to create six cubic feet of this wonderful strong building material. It's a building material that doesn't have to worry about floods because it doesn't rot. It doesn't have to worry about storms when you build it as a dome or around structure. Tornadoes can't get a hold of them. They're fireproof. They won't burn down in a forest fire. And one of my favorite aspects is the fact that it's a non-toxic building material. It's burnt limestone. It doesn't off-gas poisons. Uh, it's just really good for people who have sensitivities or just simply care about their well-being. And they can be shaped into domes, into boxes, into cylinders, into any structure you want. It can also be painted or textured or stuccoed to resemble conventional buildings. I guess the point is that it really lends itself to imagination. Um, just like a child who wants to play uh, and just enjoy themselves in the creative process, Aircrete certainly opens that world up to you. It lets you become a child again and just create fun and beauty um, and simplicity in your life. The finished cost of one of these homes starts at around $26 per square foot and how much you spend or how fancy it is entirely depends upon you. You're the creator. You get to shape things, you get to choose the materials, you get to build in the features that you love. You can carve out Aircrete as well as carve out a new life for yourself, a new way of living. And obviously, this is an alternative building material. This is not for everyone. Uh, if you want to live life in the status quo, if you want to live inside the matrix and you don't want to be unplugged and you have to get permission from your government, then this isn't for you because banks and authorities are not interested in allowing you to build this material yourself. But for the rest of you who have a free, open, adventurous, and beautiful heart, Aircrete gives us the ability to shape our lives and live it on our terms and get ourselves together in a way that doesn't require the massive inputs and bondage that comes with the conventional model for having homes. So now, 
If you're ready for a new foundation and a new way of living, walls of protection that don't break down, and a roof over your head to stay comfortable, secure, safe, and excited to live life, then Aircrete might just be for you. In the middle of a life-changing event, I decided I was going to pare down my life and I wanted to live within my means. And I wanted to escape the repressive state that I'm in. So I just thought about different ways of just kind of trying to get off grid. And this seemed to be the most reasonable amount of work versus the amount of reward that you get. And I've been looking at a uh, different way of building for probably 20 years. Um, looked at earth ships, looked at different kinds of uh, sandbags. My kids had an offer for college soon. Now I'm gonna kinda at that point want to get a new house smaller than I have now because I don't need the space. And I've looked at every kind of construction method out there, but I kinda about two, three years ago heard about air creep, saw something online, but didn't know how to do it because this is what appeals to me. Um, you know, I could afford to have a hire a builder and build a, a stick house. I can do that, I just don't want to do that. I kind of want to like to do it with my own hands. Very much appealed to me, uh, self-reliance uh, and having met him, it's only reinforced that I do. I feel very confident that I can make quality air free. I'm Charlene, this is Ron. As varied and unique as the people are who attend this workshop, everyone from doctors to just people out of high school, everyone has their own unique reason for going down this path. So now, what is your story? What is your path that has led you to Air Creek? I would love to hear about that in the comments below. For everyone who both leaves a comment, subscribes, and clicks thumbs up on this video, you'll be entered for a chance to win a free copy of the Introduction to Air Creek video course. And the bigger question is, what is your story going to be for the rest of your life? In 10, 20, 30 years from now, will you be still sitting on YouTube dreaming about living that life that fulfills that deeper calling? Or will you be surrounded by the fulfillment of your answer, having taken the action and achieved a dream? As unique as the many beautiful people are who choose Aircrete, so are the reasons for choosing Aircrete. And you'll have your own reasons as well. Now, my story starts with having worked in conventional construction and having tried my hand at every form of building, I ultimately came to Aircrete because of the allergy problems, the toxicity problems, and the fact that it's available worldwide and anybody can build a beautiful home with this. It's easy to learn, it's forgiving, and I found that other types of alternative building require tremendous, tremendous amounts of labor and earth excavation, and in terms of the cost of your time, it's just not worth it. But then when you factor in the fact that unless you're in an ideal climate, then if you have a thermal mass home, you're never going to be comfortable enough. But if you want to put in a home that is very energy efficient, use a little bit of appropriate technology, and have a house that's comfortable in any climate, any time of the year, then Aircrete really seems to be the best solution. If you're ready to embark on a new adventure, then we offer video training courses, a uh, basic introduction to Aircrete and dome building, as well as the complete step-by-step -step guide for building the little tiny roundhouse you saw behind this video and it'll teach you everything from foundation through electric and plumbing and flooring and roofing and solar power and air creek and absolutely everything that you need to be able to build your own home but then if like many of us you just really want to get the hands-on training and you don't want to travel out of the country and you want to have some extra live support from a real person later then click the link below in the description and check out our hands-on training alternative building school and workshop events we also offer customized training on the topics that you desire paid by the day